What's new in the December build of Pixel 6 ROM for the POCO F1 by OOF Gang? Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you what is new in the December build of Pixel 6 ROM based on Android 12 for the POCO F1 by OOF Gang. Of course, the security patches from December 2021, the kernel they are using is OOF Gang kernel, which is now based on Android 12. Custom kernels are supported, but once you install them, you're not going to get any support from the developers. Next up, since this is the Pixel 6 or the Pixel 6 Pro ROM, you of course have your Pixel Launcher and Select and Screenshot. Both those options are working without any issues. Next up, the internet tile has gotten a facelift. So if I tap on this, you can see that the internet tile now looks different and you also have some material you colors available for the internet tile. And before I forget, video on the previous build and how to install this build can be found in the description of the video. Next up, another place where you will find more material you theming is if you go into the home settings. Here in for starters, you will notice that the word home settings is now collapsible and it gets stickied on the top. Then all the icons over here, all the toggles over here have gotten a material you facelift as well and of course at a glance is working without any issues then while we are talking about material you do note that if you go into wallpapers and style and change the wallpaper there are now different color themes available for the same wallpaper as compared to the previous builds so if i go into the community lens and use this hot air balloon wallpaper once i apply this and we can then compare it to the color options available in the previous build here it is these are the color options available with this new android 12 build but the previous one had lesser options and if you're wondering about the lag little lag when you open the wallpapers and styles application that my dear friends is available on the pixel 6 pro as well so that is an issue at google's end then if you go into curated culture you do have three new wallpapers which have been added with the december pixel drop which are available on this specific rom another change you will notice is that when you're trying to perform a pre View. so going back into wallpapers and settings change wallpaper and when i try to change the wallpaper the widget here is now working absolutely fine previously it was showing up as only loading so that is another issue which has been addressed in this build then if you press and hold on your widgets and the options which you get on the top now do have a text besides them so you have the option of remove and you also have the option of widget settings Next up, if you swipe to access your Google feed, you will notice that the wallpaper has a blur and zoom effect. Previously, you only had the blur effect. You did not have the zoom effect. So that is also something which is pretty nifty by Google. Next up, some minute changes have been made to the system-wide search. So let us open the application drawer, try to use the system-wide search feature. And here, if I search for settings, you will notice that I now have the search icon besides the settings. And if I tap on this, it takes me to another search page, which is your search for the settings only. That This is not your system-wide search. And a bug which I found is that your gestures do not work on this specific page next up if you search for screenshot it is going to show you the photos from your photos application and these are the last three pictures and you can of course press and hold on this and share them using the quick share menu of android next up if you head over to settings and then you can go into display and in lock screen you of course have your always on display now super important thing do not enable now playing because you are going to get media lag if you do that but over here if you go into colors you of course can choose between natural boosted and adaptive but the images have now changed previously you had only one static image now you have three different images to see the changes of colors which you do and another minor change is that the toggle for your 
auto rotate screen you have the toggle on the outside as well now previously you would have to go inside and enable auto rotate screen but now you have a master toggle on the outside and the quick setting tile tells you whether face based auto detection is on or not so that is another minor change which they have done next up if you go into settings system and here and if you go into gestures go into the option of press and hold power button so this is something which you can use to invoke the assistant but now you can configure your press and hold duration as well using the slider at the bottom so those were the new changes in the pixel 6 rom and of course you do not get the material you boot animation which you get on the pixel devices next up if you head over to the play store go into settings and about you will notice that play protect certification says device is certified this means you should be able to use your banking apps without any issues the rom is not and i repeat not pre-rooted out of the box then with respect to your youtube media playback everything works absolutely fine live caption works like a boss picture in picture of course works but you need to have youtube premium or you need to be in a specific country in case you do not want to pay for youtube premium with respect to your live translate that is also working without any issues then we can jump over to the assistant lady yes she is there she works with the screen turned on and with the screen turned off as well and of course interpreter mode pixel exclusive features is present and it works without any issues as well with respect to your assistant typing in the messages application that is also working absolutely fine no issues in that regard either and the same thing applies for the recorder application and your transcript mode all those features are working like a boss on this specific build and trust me i own the redmi k20 pro the poco f1 poco x3 pro and the xiaomi mi 11x or the poco f3 and the poco f1 is a legend this is the only device so far which i have found to have all the pixel 6 exclusive features working like a boss now jumping over to the photos photos application make sure you follow the video in the description of the video to install it and unfortunately you do not get unlimited photos but what you do get is the option of magic eraser and let's go into tools magic eraser here it is finding suggestions and it will either automatically find or you can always circle it and there it is on your screen right now you can see magic eraser is working without any issues next up let us go ahead and try out the feature of portrait light now of course do note portrait light is going to work only on human objects you do have to wait for the loading bar to finish once this is done go into tools portrait light here it is portrait light in the building working without any issues and this is something which is super impressive next up let us have a look at the app opening animations to see if you have any lags or any jitters in the app opening animations so nothing like that everything seems to be working absolutely fine with respect to your recents here it is recents are pretty smooth as well then we can switch over to our google feed and see if you have any lags or any jitters in the google feed once the content has loaded everything seems to be working absolutely fine which does include the transition from google feed to home screen switching between applications is smooth as well no jitters no lags in that respect either so all in all what i have to say is poco f1 users are super lucky super awesome device super awesome developers and super awesome roms and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you